Welcome to the Rothney Astrophysical Observatory. My name is Jennifer Howes and I'm a proud member of the Métis Nation of Alberta. The Rothney Astrophysical Observatory is located under the starry skies of the traditional territories of the people of the Treaty 7 region in southern Alberta, which includes the Blackfoot Confederacy comprising of the Sitsika, Pakani and Kainai First Nations, as well as the Sutsina First Nation and the Stony Nakoda, including the Chiniki, Bearspaw, and Wesley First Nations. The City of Calgary is also home to Métis Nation of Alberta, Region 3. Astronomy helps us find our place in the universe, which best happens after we find our place on Earth. The Earth is a magnificent sphere which rotates on its axis as it moves forward on its journey around the Sun. The Earth is also tilted on an angle of 23 degrees with respect to its orbital plane. This tilt dictates the way life grows, flows and evolves here on Earth because it's responsible for the changing seasons we experience every year. The Sun rises in the east and sets in the west. The path the sun follows on its yearly journey across the sky is called the ecliptic. Here at the RAO, we are 51 degrees north latitude on the Earth, which means we are 51 degrees above the Earth's equator. The sun takes one year or 365.2422 days to complete one circuit around the ecliptic from March equinox to March equinox. A solstice marks the longest or shortest day of the solar year. The sun is highest in the sky at solar noon on the longest day of the year. Another seasonal change we observe in southern Alberta is the visible constellations in the southern sky. The northern sky constellations are the same throughout the year. A telescope is a tool used to collect the light from distant objects in space. This telescope uses mirrors that collect and reflect light and bring it to a focus. So that the telescope can follow the motion of the stars, planets and galaxies across the sky, its mount needs to be aligned with the Earth's spin axis. Finding our place in the universe in relation to our place on Earth is a goal for many people. Knowing the constellations guides our understanding of our connection to the universe. The positions and shapes made by stars in constellations, as well as the meaning of those shapes, is cultural. The International Astronomical Union recognizes 88 constellations. Indigenous peoples around the globe contributed their knowledge to create that web of measurement in the night sky. Indigenous peoples of Southern Alberta identified constellations and the motion of star shapes throughout the seasonal changes they observed every year. Identifying and predicting when a constellation would appear was part of survival knowledge, but also held spiritual significance. Hi, my name is Sir Kuchikam. Um, I'm Cree and Blackfoot. I'm Cree from Papikasi's First Nation and Blackfoot from Siksika First Nation. I was the summer student for the Indigenous Summer Student Program and my position was at the Rathni Astrophysical Observatory. The tipi is an astronomical symbol because the way that it's placed, so the eastern doorway is always facing east, and that's because we greet the rising sun that way, and we send our prayers up to Creator through the eastern doorway. It's also an astronomical symbol because of the stories on the tipis, the designs themselves. In most tipi designs, we have the, the Big Dipper, which is always on the north flap of the teepee, and then the Pleiades constellation, which is on the south flap of the teepee. And there's always a cross on the back, which represents the Blackfoot figure Morning Star, which is Venus. The design that uh, Dwayne Mistaken Chief gifted to us was kind of designed with, with myself in mind as well. So we have the red circle in the teepee, which is representative of my name, which is Mikuchi Ochutok, which means pink stone. So that's what that red rock symbolizes, and it symbolizes my participation in this project as well. And then on the, the north side of the flap, we have the Big Dipper, which is um, the seven brothers, and 
that's the constellation. And then on the south side of the flap, we have the bunch stars, which is um, the six lost boys. And then on the back, we have a morning star. On, on the bottom of the teepee is the blue points, which represents the mountains. And then within those mountains, the white circles represent puffballs. I was taught by my elder that the same word for teepee in Blackfoot is the same as um, the atmosphere, so the point between like the land and the space. And it's also the same word for our mother's womb because our mother's womb is our first home, and then after that, the land is our, our second home and our teepees are our homes as well.